and thank you to the sponsors, all of them. Coming along is the 3,000 meters, so the schedule going down is 3,000, 5,000, sprint medley girls, sprint medley boys, and then the 4x4s. Four <sighs> Thank you very much. The digital sponsored 3,000 meters for girls open is on... 3,000 on its way, 7.5 laps on a 400 track, and... Uh, not a great event for Jamaica. At least not yet, Denise Hubert. Bridge, Been a long time. Williams, uh, Sprint Heritage, MSS. powerful in Jamaica. Everyone who wants to be in athletics wants to be in a sprint-related event, whether it's hurdles or sprints. Maybe the, the job for the J3s and others is to find Jamaicans who are part of other systems who love these events, who are well prepared to do them, and uh, maybe that's the way around it in the 3,000 meters, so in the 5,000, 10,000, the steeplechase. So they're just about now pulling away from that tightly bunched pack that we were seeing earlier. Tajadine there from St. Andrew, she was second in the 1500 meters for class three girls behind Wilma's Christi Christasia Pierce. She goes to the front of this 3000 meter open. Fades back to third now. Give it the full field. Hyatt Wilma's, Tajadine, St. Andrew High. Janelle Henry saw her in the 800 meters. Wilma's, Bridge, Excelsior, uh, James, Antigua, the Queen's School. Williams, Excelsior, Hannah Charles of the Queen's School and uh, Evanescence Gore of uh, Immaculate on the outside. So that's the field. Uh, the general marker for 3,000 meters, if you're looking at something that's going to be uh, quite fast, is around about three, th three minutes per thousand kilometers. It's far too hot for that here. And uh, this group, many of them have done events before. So that's Hannah Charles of the Queen's School. She's in front and right on her shoulders, running on the outside of lane one, is Janelle Henry of Wilmers. Small field, six ladies, two from Wilmers. So that championship battle still hanging in the midst with uh, just one Wilmer, two Wilmerians, just one Excelsior girl chasing those valuable championship points. This is an individual event now, so it's 9765432-1 for the eight places. And those are the scores you get in the individual events. Again, we talk about the heat. It's quite hot here and windy and not the best conditions to be running seven and a half laps around the track for this 3,000 meters. But Hannah Charles from the Queen's School and Henry of Bulmas separate themselves and they're running one, two at the moment. Love this championship. Love what Ricky Martin and Anthrix Sports Marketing have done with with this thing over the, the decade and so it's been around. But we'll tweak some stuff. We we'll try to have these races maybe very early or a little bit later to give the ladies and the men a, a, a chance to run in more comfortable conditions. But you can't have everything, but you can want everything. Tajadeen from St. Andrew High in third spot, ensuring that she doesn't let the top two get too far from her. Charles leads Henry, Queens leading Woolmers, 347 for the first kilometer. Tajadeen closes up on Henry. There's a distinct top three. But the lady's far behind. Out of the running for the medals, but this is not just about medals, it's about points as well. As uh, both Woolmer's girls ahead of the Excelsior girl in the final. Henry would have that on her mind. I'm sure Mr. Carr reminded her before the start of this race. Valuable points up for grabs in this 3,000 meters for women open. 
Anna Charles of the Queen School, tall girl, has the lead, turns around that 200 curve, past what will end up being the JC Wall of Fame with uh, Henry. Bit more speed with that 800, has gone past her, starts to push the pace, knows how strong Charles is and may not want to leave it down to a last lap and a half push. And so has decided to take the lead and uh, push the pace on a little bit. That familiar maroon and gold. You wore it once. It's bravery personified, and Henry has it and pushes on. Ask me if I still have my jersey. <laughs> okay, you still have your jersey. I do still have my jersey. Henry of the Woolamans, Trust Girls School, Charles of uh, the Queens. Tajadine was right up with them has fallen far behind now in the chase for the top points. She's in a bronze medal position right now. And uh, maybe that's the best she can hope for for the time being. It's like James of the Queen's School, a bit further back, uh, trudging along, trying to put up big points for Queen's because of course her teammate is in second place. There's the top two, left-hand side, maroon and gold. That's Henry and uh, comfortably running in second, that's Hannah Charles. Hannah Charles does look strong trailing Henry there in second. And they're just about halfway through the race though. Janelle Henry starts to open up a bit of a gap there between her and Hannah Charles of the Queen's School. But Hannah Charles closes it back up there. I think that we'll see these two continue straight into the final lap. Henry and Charles separated themselves early, have been running together since the start of this race. Tajuddin back in third for Andrews, class three silver medalist in the 1500 meters, but the big girls are in front of her. Janelle Henry again tries to open up the gap on Hannah Charles of the Queen's School and she's doing just that. She knows Charles is very strong. She wants to get away from her, doesn't want to leave it down to the last lap, doesn't want to work too hard. She's trying to get away from her now. But Charles making every effort to stay close to Henry of Woolmers. There is a technique of surging where you test your opponent by surging, see if they will come with each surge and if they will hang back and if uh, between all of that you weaken them and that seems to be what Henry is trying to do. Henry up the back stretch towards a 2,000 meter mark with uh, Charles five meters back, but still looking quite comfortable. There was top two clear of Tajadinos and Andrew High, who was 40 meters back. That second kilometer, 404, so quite a bit slower than the first kilometer, 347, but these conditions are tough for distance racers. That's Evanes Gar of Immaculate on your screen. Back to Janelle Henry. Charles in second looking strong for the Queen School. Wouldn't write her off. She is a bit back from Henry of Woolmers as they begin to get into traffic, begin to get to back markers, and that sometimes can create a little distance. You overtake a back marker and you surge. That's simply what Henry has done. So, so Henry starting to win this battle of cat and mouse. Uh, Charles is good and strong and determined, but it looks like she's beginning to lose touch with the leader, Janelle Henry, who's trying to get a gold medal for Woolmers and important points. Less than 800 meters to go in this eight, in this 3,000 meter open for girls and Janelle Henry of Woolmers leads. Hannah Charles, the Queen School in second. Henry working hard, trying that, to get the full 10 points for Woolmers. That gap, 20 meters, just about. Charles in the gray and with that red stripe across her chest for the Queen School. They're running into back markers now and let's watch Henry about to get to her teammate teammate lets her through on the inside that's sportsman like and uh, Henry
keeps moving her team it was like she wants to stop but those points needed for Wulma so she can't afford to stop has to stay in front of the Excelsior girl but here is Janelle Henry I think she's broken Charles comes now with 500 to go she looks a bit renewed there in her demeanor seven and a half laps no mean feet and Janelle Henry continues to lead Hannah Charles fading back there but still in silver position for the Queen's School as Henry goes into the final lap she's got good speed so run 800 meters today and now she hits the gas again she's broken Charles the Queen's girl who has uh, been resolute in her pursuit but has steadily lost ground it's uh, Henry who heads down the back straightaway again you can see the feather banners around the back all blowing anti the direction of where uh, Reed is where Henry is going here comes Charles mounting a surge on the back straightaway can Janelle Henry hold her off Charles played possum lots of energy on this last lap this is uh, Henry with 200 to go and Charles is catching up here's another sprint from Janelle Henry both girls cat and mouse and the last stanza of this poem is that Woolmans has played better cat and mouse in the 3,000 meters than the Queen's School it's the outstanding effort from Henry that gives her school nine points in the 3,000 meters Charles has done well but Henry comes through 11.31.5 her last lap 78 seconds to win nine points for her school nine points for Woolmans there from Janelle Henry that was an impressive run for her and Hannah Charles of the Queen's School, both ladies put on a good performance over the seven and a half laps of this 3,000 meters. Impressive running from Janelle Henry. There is Tajadine from St. Andrews High for girls. Comes in, still holding the bronze medal position. Crosses the line third. Tajadine from St. Andrew High gets the bronze. 12 10 point six on my clock unofficial for her it's impressive by Henry been busy but comes here and puts nine points in the saving plan for Wolmers and Michael Carr battle not over the race still in progress Wolmers still up against Excelsior, Felicia Bridge, the Excelsior girl. That's Hyatt of Wilma, still in the mix. Still has points that she can make up for her team. As it comes down to every point that counts between Excelsior High on the girl side and Wilma's girls. Bridge is still going for Excelsior, but she's half a lap behind Bridge, behind uh, her Wilma's rival who is uh, uh, trying to finish strong for her school. Hyatt, this is James of the Queen's School. Big and strong and powerful. But the battle for points continues right to the very end. Woolmers with Amanda Hyatt, there she is on the screen. She knows that even though she's tired, even though she can't lift her knees, even though she's drifting out of her lane to the side, that the point she can score could make the difference. Here she is, concentrating past the pain, focused on the points for her school. In the final straightaway, where the applause begins to gather. Woolmans, chi ching ching in the saving pan and come through to score. Not a bad position either that she finishes fifth. Amanda Hyatt for Woolmans, second Woolmans athlete through the line. Two for Queens already. Hannah Charles finished second. 
and Tanika James, the Antiguan, finished fourth. Of course, Janine Henry Wilmers won the whole thing. Here's Bridge of Excelsior. Finds a semi sprint at the end. Well done, but behind the Wilmers girls, both of them. And uh, finishing Felicia Bridge of Excelsior. And finally, we welcome Evanescence Gorge. Final athlete on the home straight there, Evanescence Gaw of Immaculate. Getting some encouragement there from the crowd to finish. It's always important to finish the race. So seven and a half laps, not easy. So well done to her. And well done to the fans for encouraging her through the line. And some encouragement from Henry of Woolmers. I think Henry's gone across to try to get her some water. She was clapping her last steps. Um, uh, big effort. Down the stretch to finish for him, 